What's up, everyone? It's Keith the Robo Duke. D. Nice. Or Dennis. Or Dennis. Or Dennis. Or just Keith. I mean, whatever. We're fast and loose here on the Double D's channel. We're back with another Nerd Block unboxing. This is for June 2015. And unlike Loot Crate, Nerd Block doesn't have a theme. They don't. It's sad. Sad face. Yeah. Uh, which we experienced in one of our other videos. Be sure to go check out our horror block. Uh, what was the other block called? Arcade block. Arcade block. block. Arcade block horror block video for more info on uh, themes. Themes! But uh, why don't you just jump in, man? Let's, on, let's just get jump right to in. It. People want to see the toys and the prizes so, and the things. Let's see what we got. Let's go for the t-shirt first because there's always a t-shirt. Yeah, that's that the is cool. the one thing I like. Always a t-shirt. Yep, nerd block. And it's always a t-shirt from Shirt Punch. Bam! Shameless <laughs> plug. <laughs> Shirtpunch.com endorse us. So what we got? That's pretty interesting. I like it. It's just, do you know what that is? I want to say no. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I want to say no. Uh, that is a Sherlock Holmes T-shirt. Interesting. That is for the uh, uh, Bender Snitch Cumble Brands uh, lead. In uh, Sherlock Holmes. That's a t-shirt. That's their wall. Sher Sherlock Holmes. Sherlock Holmes. In their apartment, there's like a smiley face on the wall. It doesn't say bored, but that's been, that's his character. His character gets bored. He needs I've to keep never, busy. I don't ever recall seeing that. And you should watch it. Everyone I have watched there. it. I watched all three seasons? I don't know. I think three. Three seasons. Either way. Cool shirt. Trace. Trace. Oh, and you just learned something. Spanish for three. That is Spanish for three. And also know that turtle is tortuga because tortuga <laughs> is a fun word to say. It is. What else we so, got? So, all right, this is why I'm starting to really dig nerd block. Oh, more peoples. More peoples, but not just more peoples. That's not just any peoples. The doctor. And it's the David Tennant doctor, everybody's absolute favorite. The tenth doctor. Yeah, look, check him out. Look at him. He's so cute. Does he have a... Oh, he looks like he has a... Does he have his uh, screwdriver in here? Do you care? For, should I open him? Let's open it. You go for the next thing, and I'm going to work on opening the doctor... Getting the doctor out of his uh, TARDIS here. So, <laughs> do you know what this is? <laughs> it's a cute little... It's cute. This is actually Mr. Bean's <gasps> teddy bear. Oh, my God. It actually is Mr. Bean's teddy bear. Mr. Bean's teddy bear. I believe his name is... <laughs> Since that's all Mr. Bean ever fucking said. So, Teddy, you can go there. So, what's next? A bendable <laughs> Mr. Bean. <laughs> the cartoon, which I think they use as like inner, like uh, little stingers and little interstitials in the show, actually. But I bet there's a full animated version over in the UK or something. Oh, like most that. likely. I'm willing to bet. And yes, the doctor does come with his sonic screwdriver. So, that is. So, clearly, we can now tell that Nerblock is associated with Titan, because all of their figures are Titan figures, because yep. we got the Ectoplasm. Is that what it's called? The Ecto-1. Ecto-1. Unless it's the Ecto-2, but I'm pretty sure it's the Ecto-1. It's the Ecto-1. So, so you know, they're Ecto all Titans, but then all of our Nerblocks are Funko Pops. Yeah, we can see where these people are making uh, ties with other ties. companies. Yeah. Do you see the theme? Not yet. You don't. Have you? Oh, I do see the theme. I got it. You I got, got, you got it. it. You see what this, this is? I, yeah, I, this is pretty fucking amazing. This I is really pretty like cool. this. This is Monty P M Monty's Python. Monty's Monty, Python. Monty Python. It's basically those like those like haiku things. Yeah, they're the uh, multiple message magnets. Monty's multiple message magnets. And yeah, this just has a bunch of words that you would associate with Monty Python. It says the holy grail of magnetic poetry, but there's all sorts of things in here. The 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 magnet in the middle here is from the uh, Her. the silly walks sketch. You know, there's words like spam. Actually, there's four different ones that say spam, which is appropriate. I like the very first line. I'm a lumberjack and I'm okay. Right at the top there. How great is that? That's really awesome. These are really cool. I love these. These are fucking amazing. So, so do you get the theme now? Yes, I'm assuming the theme is British. Yes, the theme is definitely Brits. British. These are all British. Uh, these are all BBC properties, I think. I don't know about Mr. Bean or Monty Python, but Holmes is definitely a BBC show. Ooh, 
Print with the uh, Weeping Angels, the Cybermen, and the Silence. The Silence. Oh, and apparently, we have according, the theme. According to this, it is glow in the dark. Ooh. Oh, because he's got the and there's the sonic the screwdriver. Sonic screwdriver. So, so I think That's I might nice. I might actually get a frame for that. I think it's that. I think this would be really cool to frame, and especially if like you turn it off at night and you're like, ooh, spooky. British invasion. There we go. Bam. Now the thing is, maybe we're just not paying attention. Maybe uh, Dennis here is getting notifications about the theme, but not noticing. No, really. Nope. Okay, then I kind of think it's neat that they don't tell you then. Yeah, you have no idea what it is until you get it. Yeah, but also, if I knew what this was, I may have gotten it. Because I am... Fair enough. I am quite the Anglophile. That is true. I, I do love uh, British television. I mean, hence I picked up on the theme pretty quick. But I love this little bear. The bear is awesome. It's cute. He's adorable. Going to my niece. Mm, there you go. Very my nice. My niece is going to get that. And that's the fun thing about a lot of these boxes is you may not like everything in them, but you may know someone who does. And someone who could use it. Yes. So, thank you again for watching another video. Thanks. Thanks a lot, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope uh, maybe this inspires you to go get a nerd block of your own. You can go to nerdblock.com for that. They're picking up their game. I am. I feel like they started out, you know, like three four items and now they're starting to get like you know six seven items and um i don't really think they had themes to be I mean, they had a theme like it was like the kevin smith theme where it was like everything was 80s it's yep. a crappy theme but anime last month that was good british invasion this month this and, is good and the simon Pegg picks was another one as well where it was all things but that was still but only it was like, like stuff that he picked out personally yeah. yeah that's not that's not a theme to me they're getting better they are getting better this one is really really good i am um, i'm glad i'm on the ground floor for uh nerd block because i feel like it's only gonna get better yeah so as i was saying as well Thank you for watching. Thank you. Subscribe. Subscribe. Like. Like. Watch some more videos. Watch some more videos. We got a lot of cool stuff there. We got there. a lot of cool stuff there. We have all sorts of things. We have all sorts of things. <laughs> Watch us play some video games. Watch us play some video games. Do it. Do it. Now. Now. Bye. Bye. <laughs> you dick.